So Talia Randall, mark of the year last year. We know she's got the aerial skills. What about the kicking skills? Bang on, Talia Randall secures their first for the season. Here's Brown, inside 50. Can they find the mark? There's a good fly to be a free kick. And that might be Sophia McCarthy, the debutante. It is. Advantage is going to be paid. Jazzy Garn is going to deny the debutante her first shot at goal. But Jazzy's kicked her first, and there'll be many more to come this season. And Garner inside your forward 50. Why wouldn't you get it deep inside there and allow these players to run and jump at the mark? Played in those two lose losing grand finals for Brisbane Lions as a defender. But that seems like an eternity ago because she's turned herself into a goal-kicking machine for the Roos. Randall's got two. Kick finds Riddell, gives the overlap run to King. Look at her take off from 50. Has she got the journey? It's going to go very close. If it doesn't, Rennie, who's resting in the goal square, will kick the goal. That's a luxury when you've got the two tools. North Melbourne have proved to, to be a real difference here in this game. She's kicked a goal in every quarter. Talia Randall, for the first time in her career, she's got three goals to her name. Randall's having a day out, and so too are the Roos. Players might have just... Convinced Yeah, the convinced player. the umpire, haven't they? So Sophia McCarthy had a chance tonight in the first term, had a shot in the second term. Can she get her first AFLW goal in the third term? She does. And what a special moment for the youngster.